Hey everybody, how's it going? We're back with another stream. We're going to be doing the unicorn pack again, like we've been doing all week. Um, I got Froge on here, just barely started, so we're going to see. Um, I want to do a couple different fun things with the unicorn pack. So I was thinking of doing, splitting it up into colors. So saying you can only buy blue pets or red pets or something like that. I think that'd be fun to try to get going. So I'll let a couple more people file in here. If you want to join yourself, the code is salmon. Um, you can join on mobile or PC. So let me get some, some music going. So I think we're going to start pretty early. Um, probably right at four with this one. Uh, we can do a small little group and then more people can file in. Hey, Parsa, how's it going? Yeah, so we're, we're going to be doing the unicorn pack again. The first run is going to be just normal, whatever. And then I'm wanting to mix it up a little bit and maybe for certain colors or certain pets, certain builds. Um, we can discuss that in the chat. So I think it'll be fun. So we're going to be starting exactly at 4 p.m. So just in about three minutes here. So if you want to join, you got to join pretty quickly. It is really fun. I think it's my favorite pack now. I know it's very OP compared to everything else, but it's very fun to play with. Parsa, do you have the packs or have you just been able to play from the streams? Hey, Alex, how's it going? So I'm going to be starting exactly at 4 p.m. Once I see it hit 4, we're going to be starting. So if you want to join, make sure to hop on. The code is salmon. We got some of the regular guys here. We got Froze, Dylan, Badger. OP isn't the issue, it's also broken. Yes. Hey, JJ. Yeah, it's just a crazy, crazy pack. So. Okay, looks like we got one more minute now. Do you guys know when they're gonna be doing some updates to the pack and trying to balance everything? Cause I went on their discord and I was looking at it and it looks like they were kind of talking about it. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, yeah, they're working on fixing bugs and balancing the most overpowered unicorn pets. I don't, I don't think they said which ones though. So, okay, probably 10 seconds or so, and then we'll be able to get going. Hey, Wild Stoke. All right, it's 4 p.m. Let's get started. So this is just going to be normal. No restrictions or anything. Uh, let's go. We're still going with the Jiggly Bits. I feel like I need to change it up on the names. Yeah, so there's how many six of us in here? So this one I feel like should go pretty quickly. The biggest bug you've seen is an old mouse. Uh, I've only bought it once and I didn't really like it. 
But what was the bug that you saw, JJ? That's good. We got a dub. Ooh, I like that. Um, I think we'll go like that. Okay. So we could possibly get a level up on the Bunyip and the Bargus. So. Okay, so I think Dylan's going for the level ups with the Wumple. No level up for its toy? Yeah, that is a big bug. Let's go. Bigfoot. Um, we'll get a level up in battle. I think that'll be decent. We didn't get a level up in our shop, though. Yeah, so Old Mouse. Oh, it's on the... It's in Customs. So I can't look at it right now. But there's like, what, 12 different toys? 8 or 12 different toys that you can randomly get. Ooh. Dang it. Okay, there's a level up. Um, I can sell here. The more weakness. And then there's another level up. So we could get a vampire. We could get a lot of different things. We could get Cyclops on the next one. Chimera, The Rock. I haven't really gone with the visitor yet. I did see that some people were talking about how they could change the vampire bat. So instead of dealing three damage, for any enemy that gets an ailment, it just steals it. So like, or just remove it instead of dealing, I guess. Have I done the weekly yet? I have not. I've only been doing unicorn pack. Bring in the wiring. Oh, I don't want to do it, but I'm going to. Um, I know going Chimera, Chimera is a little scummy. I guess I should pin the the comment that I had saying what the code is. Okay, let's see. So Stoats on two, Froze is on three. Hars is killing it on five. JJ, have you done the weekly yet? Okay, so we'll get three weakness if they don't have any yeah. Looks good. Yeah, there's some weakness. Ooh. Yeah, Parsa's killing it right now. Okay, let's go level up there. I guess we're going with some mana right now. Uh, I'll keep rolling. There's another Frost Wolf. So I'm not sure what 
I'm wanting to go for. What's a build that I haven't really gone for? I haven't really done jump builds before. I would love to get the level up build going. I'm either doing weekly or turtle versus. Gotcha. Yeah, I, I feel like I haven't done the weekly in a, a while. I mean, I posted a video about it last week, I think. There was one where I thought I was playing the weekly, but I wasn't. Okay, so we'll take him out. Break his melon. Barely make it through on that one. Okay, there's... Okay. I think my Wi-Fi went out for like a split second. Um, we'll go here, here, there. Okay, that was scary. That's why you like to join the stream and mix it up. Yeah, I've been wanting to do almost like a custom pack on the stream but I'm not quite sure I kind of want to do like the thing that Kino was doing where you have a specific goal in mind Ooh. wow so it has the, the build going I think I'm going for too many things. We'll get a vampire of our own. Keep rolling. I think we're going to get rid of the Chimera. Hey, Alex, welcome to the, the channel members. Thanks for joining. Yeah, so I, I kind of, I'm split between three builds, and I shouldn't be doing that. Like, I want to go for the Vampire and Frostwolf, just because it's pretty strong. But I also want to do the level up with the Lucky Cat and Cyclops and Team Spirit. That could be good. Um, I don't think I want to go Chimera. Because I, I feel like I do that way too much. Oh. Oh, ho, ho, he's huge. JJ, what are you doing? <laughs> um, sell there. Get rid of Chimera. Oh, there's another lucky cat. Perfect. We're not going to go Nessie. Okay. So we'll get two level ups now. We got to level up the Cyclops as well. If we could get him to level three, that'd be huge. Sorry, not sorry. It's okay. I forgive you. I, I do it all the time. So. Oh, Froge and Stoat are out. I didn't even realize that. Oh, and I'm on freaking one heart. Shoot. I didn't even realize that either. Okay, so Dylan's got two Cyclops going. He's going with the level up team. I really need to stop watching you in the stream and missing at least the first run. Yeah, that's a mistake. I mean, at least you can kind of stream snipe a little bit. Okay, we took out. Oh, I don't think we have enough. No. Parsa took us out. I was going for way too many builds all at once. Whoa. 
I've never had a level three wyvern though. So this is Parsa. There's three left. JJ's almost out. I really should try a Quetzalcoatl build. So give one random tier three or, for, or lower friend plus two experience. Does it? It's always below tier three. So who's that gonna trigger? understand what Parse is going for on this one. I really need to stop doing my homework during the streams. I lose so much time on my turns. Yeah. Hopefully I'm not taking away from your studies though. Hey, thanks for joining Stoat. I'm glad you could join for the short while. That's why Cyclops is so good though. You get an instant level three if you can get it to level two. So. Okay, so the Gargoyle, he's gonna spend some mana. <laughs> he 32 health? Okay, that's crazy. Okay, so we got three more left. JJ's holding on. Hey, Quentin, how's it going? Thanks for joining the stream. I appreciate the support. It means a lot to me. Okay, what is he going for this time? Okay, so he's going to be getting more rolls. It works pretty easy. <laughs> you care more about the stream than the work anyway. What, what kind of homework are you working on? Is it like math, English, or something crazy? Hey, there's your level three Cyclops. You just gotta freeze both of them. So who's your favorite custom exclusive unicorn pack pet? Custom exclusive. I just barely finished up filming a video yesterday with the Anubis and that one is pretty crazy. Oh, he missed out. But the Chimera is too big. Um, so I was using the Anubis with... Um, I tried getting it to level 3. And then I had Lionfish. I had Warthog. I had Mammoth. And so what the Anubis does is it will trigger a faint pet's ability at start a battle. And so as you level it up, it'll go from... I think tier two and lower, then tier four and lower, and then tier six and lower. And so I just packed the whole thing with tons of faint pets and it was awesome. Oh, I see what Parse is going for. He's going with the... Okay. I see what he's doing. So he's kind of creating a summon team here. That's going to go crazy because then any pet that you bring in there is just basically a 50-50. I know, the unicorn pet packs are insane. Maybe that's what I should have tried doing when I was trying to get 100-100 behemoth. Kind of pump up the Jersey Devil with this build and then just buy a bunch of the behemoths, that might work. You just finished a bit a bit of science. Okay, and it was almost done, nice. 
Dang. Yeah, I remember when I was going over the whole pack, and I saw this one, I was like, eh, it's not that good. And same with Jersey Devil, but as I see people use it more and figure it out, it goes crazy. Yeah, here's a good um, level up build. I don't think it's enough, though. No. Hey, JJ, you're still hanging in there, though. That's that's impressive. I mean, you got some pretty good summons there. You're going to have a huge Nessie with the, the Yetis. I do really like the, the Magic Beans. I think it's a great food perk. Yeah, so what is he giving now? Plus five, plus five. Plus six, plus six. Yeah, so who's he gonna go up against? Hmm. Does the Mandrake also change? It does change. It goes up to four and six for the tiers. Dang. Yeah, so Pars is still at three. Oh. I don't know. I don't think that helped you, though. I feel like if it would have silenced the, the Chimera, that would have been better. So in your opinion, I understand you haven't completely finished Unicorn Pack and the custom exclusives. So what pets do you think should get buffed and which ones should be nerfed? So Unicorn exclusively, I think Vampire Bat needs to be nerfed. He needs to be changed a little bit. So instead of dealing damage, it'll just remove the damage. Kind of like how Skunk removes damage. But instead of as a percentage, it'll just do the, the number amounts. Um, and then it can regain that health. Just so it doesn't trigger off of those ailments that the enemy gets. That would make it a little weaker. Um, I think they need to change Chimera. So instead of spending one mana for plus one plus two, I think they should say spend two mana for plus one plus one. Or they could keep it plus one plus two. Because I think if they change it down to plus one plus one, it still wouldn't be enough. Um, and then... Yeti... I feel like they need to change it slightly. Um, I don't know. I don't know how they could do it, though. Maybe just roll less, so do roll two times, four times, and then six times. Because basically, if you have a level three Yeti and a level three Nessie, like, it's going to get maxed out completely. So, um... And then everything else I feel like is pretty balanced. I know some people have complained about the behemoth and how it has so much health, but I I don't think having the 100 limit on it is is a big issue. So, oh, having Cerberus with Jersey Devil, that's good. Let's see. Oh, he got the level up. And then he's rolling the dice. Mushroom. I mean, he's going to come back as a 1-1. A one, one. Oh. 
he silenced the Chimera. That's huge. All right, GG to everyone. All right, so you guys can join. So Salmon's the code. It's amazing that the Behemoth is the only pet in the game that has defense and health that can go above 50. I, I don't know if it's OP exactly, but at least in Unicorn Pack, it's, I would say it's pretty fair. Um, but if you can have like an insane scaling team, then yeah. If you just throw the Behemoth into any other pack like Turtle, then it's gonna crush everything. So I think for this round, if you're joining, instead of being able to play whatever, I think um, just being able to buy blue or red pets. Which one do you guys want to do? Do you guys want to do blue or red? Alex said, I really want to play with you, but I also want to see the stream. <laughs> um, I mean, you can watch. Um, I don't care if you stream snipe. It's this is all for fun. So, yeah, what do you guys think? Should we limit it in this? Um, you want to do red? And I'll be a little loose with how you see red. So if it's like an a dark orange or whatever like that, then that'll be fine. So yeah, so let's do only red pets in this one. Oh shoot, JJ's colorblind. <laughs> um, th that's okay, I'll be a little lenient. As long as it's not like crazy obvious, but like, I don't know what kind of colorblindness you got. So I think next time Parso we'll do blue after this one. Yeah. So yeah, that's correct. So, so we're only going to be playing with red pets. JJ, if you buy one that's red, I'll just say that one's not red and then it'll be fine. You can just sell the next time or whatever. So, okay, we'll wait uh, 10 more seconds or so. I, I think it'll be fun though, try to limit ourselves. We could do other ones like only um, mana pets or only whatever. Whatever you guys wanna do, I'm good with. So try to think of some for the next round. Okay, let's get going. Oh, shoot. <laughs> That's not red at all. And there's no red right here. Oh, shoot. Yeah, so like the Warg, he's blue and red. I would count the Shuchiniko as red. And I guess the, would you guys say the Baku's red? I know it's like pink. I guess I should have clarified like what's red. So. So I guess going through here, we'll say Baku, Shuchiniko. I don't know how I feel about Warg because he's mostly purple. I mean, the, the Cuddle Toad is obviously not red. Wait, who did I go against? Did I go against JJ? No, I didn't. I don't know. What do you guys think? Um, I guess we're going multiple. I guess I should have clarified this a little bit better.
Hey, you're doing great, JJ. Make a rainbow pack next. So someone did share... So for one of the 1v1s that I did, they had... Um, they had the rainbow pack from like months ago. Okay, so I could get the Ouroboros. Maybe red wasn't the best, because like most of them are tier six or whatever. Okay, let's try it though. Oh. <laughs> I guess another one. And then there is Mandrake red. I was debating that because like the pot is red. Sure, I'll say Mandrake's red. So Mandrake, Cali Greyhound, I guess he's like a yellow. And then Ouroboros, but then the Griffin's also yellow. LeBun has a rainbow pack. I will, I'll message LeBun to see if he can send me that. Let's see. Or maybe he already did send it to me. Okay, here's another level up. Oh, shoot. Um, let me see if I can find that rainbow pack. Okay, I think I... Yeah, I have the rainbow pack. Does Jackalope have red horns? Let's see. I would say that's brown. I mean, the lucky cat has red on it, but it's not like a majority of red. And then Mothman has like purplish red circles. So yeah, I didn't think this through all the way. Does the ward count as red? That's what I'm trying to debate. Save those for a level up. Oh. Let's just give him stats then. What do you guys think? Do, should the ward count? I mean, it is a darker shade than the Baku is, but it's like a majority of the bluish purple. I, I would say that's on the blue side. Only jump pets would be fun and either unicorn or custom. Rock is red. Yeah, I would say rock is red. The tassel worm, the kraken. Um, the chimera is not. And then I would say Jersey devil, salmon of knowledge, red dragon, obviously the red dragon. Hey, that's not, that's not red. <laughs> That's green. Come on, Devin. Okay, let's see. And you can buy whatever during your turn. It's just when you hit end turn, you have to have um, the red pets. There's another one. I'm going to say Lucky Cat has red. Yeah, maybe we should go through and add some of the custom pets and try to do a certain color.
I've never really tried to go with the Ouroboros, though. What is the restrictions for pets? Just red. And we're being kind of lenient on that. So, like, this is obviously pink, but it's close. Okay, I think... Beep, beep. I think he got me on that one. Okay, lucky cat. Keep rolling, I guess. There's another Shuchiniko. We're going Kraken. There's another Baku. So we'll get a level up. But Pierce, I think next time we're going to try to go with blue. I think there's more blue pets. And I'll, I'll make sure to define what it's going to be. Okay, so Stoat and Badger are out. So JJ, I'm just wondering, what does since you said you're colorblind, is this red to you? Is it does it look like a red dragon? Oh, he's got the Kraken. Dang. Okay, level up there. <laughs> Look at that, that's the first time I've got it. Go there. This cat's not doing much though. Yeah, green slash red color blindness is a thing. Yeah, that's what I was trying to make sure of. It doesn't look red, but I thought you said it. Oh, because of like the tongue? No, I was talking about the lucky cat. That's my bad. I mean, there is, his tongue is red. It's showing. Yeah, I didn't plan this one very well. Sorry about that. But this, I would say this is fairly red except for Dylan you got you got some green in there that's cheating oh yeah I could have been talking about the Ouroboros instead of the Ogopogo yeah I mean the Ouroboros is very red it might be an orange like a dark orange but it's it's very close. Oof. Yeah, the tassel worm would be good in this one. We'll go there, gingerbread. Um, I'm gonna go salmon. Lucky cats going there. The Baku is the worst tier one in the game. Yeah. Like, what's his ability? He adds, if it's even, replace ailment on one random friend. So, I mean, it removes an ailment, which is decent, and then it gives him health, but, like, it's only on even turns. So, it's not very good. We only have one more of the Witch Broom as well. I think I'm going to get taken out. Yeah, Dylan, you can't be having that. Come on. Buy a wall chicken for attack and then sell for help. Mm. 
I guess that could work. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, that was sweet. Would that work, though? Can I get... Oh, there's a tassel on. I'm gonna sell the Baku. Baku, Baku. Does that work if you buy the wall chicken? So, like, if I bought it right now, would it replace it? Because that... That would be better than I would think. Okay, let's see. Okay, so he's not hitting the cat. That's my bad. Yeah, come on, Dylan. Come on. <laughs> I can't compete with that. I'm out. Sadly. Okay, so now that I'm out, I can focus on trying to figure out what the next one will be. What do you guys think? What should be the next restriction? I'm open to any idea. And it can be over any pack. I'm fine with doing custom, with doing um, really anything. Cerberus is definitely red. What is spend mana to remove one health? Interesting. Jump and jump related? Is Manticore red? Yeah, I would say Manticore's red. And then Cerberus, Phoenix. I'm debating... I mean, Quetzalcoatl's mainly green. So... I think we could do jump pets next. We can stay on the unicorn pack and just do jump. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? Yeah, I think Dylan's gonna win. I wonder if he saw and he's like, oh, that's weird that everyone's doing red pets, you know? Hard names to say only. I mean, to me, some of them, I guess that one would be, like Alchemides, that might be hard to some people, but not to everyone. Maybe he didn't listen to the rules and can't watch the stream at the same time. That's what I'm thinking happened, because I did post this on Discord. So maybe he joined through Discord and he's not watching the stream. That could be it. Oh, Phoenix and Manticore would go pretty well. <laughs> or maybe he's colorblind and he thinks the Cyclops is red. Because he has like all Cyclops. But it looks like Froge is taking him out. I don't know. Well, if I say doing the jump one, then maybe we can pinpoint that he's colorblind. I don't know. But it might be that he didn't, he's not on the stream, so. Cyclops looks reddish brown to me. Oh. And you said you have um, 
what type of colorblindness? Is it just red green colorblindness or? Yeah, because I know that is one that you can mix up. So. Yeah, when I thought of doing colors, I didn't even think about anyone having colorblindness. Even tears only? That's a good idea. Dang. Froze is going hard. that on the salmon, yeah. And then probably just buy the porridge is what I would do. Okay, which one would you guys rather do? Would you rather do only jump pets? Like anywhere where it says jump in their description or even tears only? He has four level three Cyclops. Your colorblindness is not too bad, but red, green, and blues can be difficult. Man, that take, took forever to do. Okay, Dylan's coming back. So AJ, you're saying jump. It's also more restrictive and luck dependent though. Alex says jump. Oh, there's a chocolate. Okay, let's see. So he's going against a clone. Okay, so it's Frozen Dylan. Raptor says jump. So we got three on jump. Oh. I mean, you're basically gonna have a, a level three Manticore. Oh yeah, that's probably smart. Oh my gosh. Froj official winner of the red teams. That, oh geez. We're just gonna sit here forever. What the heck, Dylan? <laughs> Jeez, that took forever. Dang. Yeah, Dylan didn't have red, but maybe he didn't think it was. I don't know. I know, Froge. His, <laughs> his build takes so long to go through. Should include all push and shuffle pets, except Iguana. And I don't, I don't know if you can beat him though. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. <laughs> Parsa says the crisp ailment counts as red for Dylan. Okay, we got one more of it. All right. I mean, I I don't think there's anything you can do. Yeah, you, you just gotta buy stats, but even then it's not gonna do much.
And here we go again. Um... Yeah. Maybe they should change the Cyclops. Like, is there not a way that they can speed up the animation for this? Holy crap. 48 mana on everything? Oh? Oh no, the mana got him. Man, Froze, you were so close, dude. Dang. Okay, so we're doing jump pets. I think we're gonna stay in Unicorn Pack, just to make it simple. Does that sound good? So you can only buy jump pets. So that's gonna be pets like the Jackalope, the Drop Bear, the Tiger Bug. Yeah, Froze, you were killing it in there. You were so close. So yeah, this one's gonna be a little bit of luck and RNG, so. Yeah, Parsa, jump only. So on this first round, I think you can only buy the Shuchinika. I think that's the only one that's in there. Hey, it's okay, Dylan. It was, it was kind of funny, though. I wasn't sure if you had some colorblindness or not, but it, it was funny watching, so. Yeah, so jump and jump related. Fairy dust does not count, true. So you can't buy any pet and just put fairy dust on it. So in the description of their ability, it has to say jump somewhere. I think the Loveland frog counts, yeah. Okay, I'll wait 10 more seconds for you guys to hop on in. Yeah, because I think it says jump on the Loveland Frog. All right, let's get it. Jump pets only. Okay, there's a Shuchinika. I You can buy and sell. You just have to hit. Once you hit end turn, you can only have jump pets. Oh, nice. I got another one. Um, yeah. Okay, let's see. Waiting on quite a few of you. Two more, one more. Yeah. So I can't buy any of those. There's another one. It's just Shuchiniko. So, yeah, so Shuchiniko, um, the Drop Bear, Jackalope, and then the Brain Cramp. Tiger bug. Hey, thanks for joining the stream, Dylan. Hey, it's okay. You didn't ruin it. It was fun. So, thanks for joining, though. Okay. Um, can't get any of those. I can grab the drop bear. I could level up into a brain cramp. Okay, there's another Shuchiniko. OK. 
Okay. Um, what else is there? So there's the tiger bug. There's the Loveland Frogman. Is that it? I think that's it. I don't think there's any tier sixes. Oh, sorry, Parsa. Oh, you got the brain cramp. Oh, I sniped him. Oh, JJ, did you get the Water of Youth and you got the Shuchinika? Um, I'm going to put it on the drop there. Oh, shoot, I messed up. I should have bought and sold him first. Okay, let's see. Everybody's got jump. That's jump. All right, we're doing good. I wish I could get a jackalope. <laughs> oh, we actually win that one. Nice. Okay, I can buy sell there. Um, let's go magic wand. There's a jackalope. Okay. Yeah, I like this one so far. It's been, this is fun. So hopefully he'll give it to the drop bear because then the drop bear will do six damage. And getting the tiger bug Tiger bug is really good. Okay, let's see what everyone else is doing. Is Shuchiniko jumping from front to front a bug? Um, oh, I missed it. What does it say? I don't think so, because it doesn't say if the space is empty. It just says jump to the front. So I don't think it's a bug. Go there. Oh, nice. There's a brain cramp. Ooh. That is good. That is good stuff right there. Okay, let's see. Sorry, I'm just switching up the music a little bit. Okay, let's see what everyone else is doing. Drop bears, they got, yeah, they're all doing it properly. Okay, let's see. Nice. Man, my Wi Fi's being terrible right now. There we go. Ooh, it's being laggy. We'll go level two. There's another one. Whoa, why is it being so laggy? Okay, let's see. Oh, Pierce got a tiger bug and so did Raptor. Dang. I think if I find a tiger bug, I'll combine my Shuchinikos. Okay. 
Oh, you have to go, Alex? Hey, thanks for joining. And thanks for becoming a channel member. I appreciate that a lot. I'll just have to catch you on the next stream. Okay, they cancel out. And we're good. there just so he gets the level up yeah this drop bear we haven't found any other ones so does he deal two four six yeah okay and also you guys um Try to think of another restriction, or we can keep doing this one multiple times if you guys want to. Oh shoot. Oh, we're good. We're actually doing pretty decent on this one. There's another drop bear. And then I'll go here, buy, sell. Um, which broom? Or maybe I shouldn't have gone. Ooh, we got the tiger bug. Nice. Oh, if bros, you're out. Dang. Okay, everyone's starting to get the tiger bug now. Honestly, the Shuchaniko and the Jackalope, that's a good combo. If you had like tons of Jackalopes and just one Shuchaniko, then they'd go crazy. Oh, our Jackalope. <laughs> no! <laughs> Dang it. there as well. Dang, nothing good. Dang. So now we can put, like, we could probably buy the Cornucopia or put the Yg Yggdrasil? Yg Yg I can't pronounce it. Yggdrasil fruit. Okay, let's see. So, Yuk and I, we both got four hearts. Two, and then one, one, one. Okay, we're waiting on one more person. There we go. Okay, he's gonna be sniping. Ah, oh, I sniped our jackalope. AJ. Another jump build or mana build? We can do another jump build. Um, no, I don't want that. I'll keep rolling. No more Shuchinikos. I haven't found any more jackalopes though, which is insane. Oh, you got the Loveland frog. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be really good. If we find one, I think, I don't know what I'd get rid of though. Maybe the drop bear? Or 
I'm, I'm not sure. I kind of want to get rid of the Chuchinico. But he's kind of big. Oh, they're going to snipe again. Okay, it didn't take out our Jackalope, which is nice. But it took out everything else. <laughs> hey, Gaming Grandpa. Welcome to the stream. Um, I think we got to put that on him. Let's see. Don't need any more brain cramps. And then I think we'll put that on him because he doesn't need the extra gingerbread either. I don't know how many self, how many pets self harm in this pack though. Um, are there any? You've had almost zero success with the jump build gaming. I had on my very first one. Oh, oh, he survived. Oh. <laughs> The great one can't stop us. Okay, there's another one. And another one. Um, let's buff him up. Phoenix kinda does? I guess so, yeah. With the crisp. Because it does target any of yours as well. I think that's the only one that... Because it's Phoenix and then it's the Red Dragon that used Crisp, right? Oh, you got double Loveland Frog. He's huge. <sighs> nice. I don't know how, but we are barely surviving. You love the Peach of Immortality, but it's so unreliable. Yeah, you just have to buy so many. Okay, we'll level up the Tiger Bug. There's the Loveland Frog, but I think we stick with what we got. It's been working for us. It would be fun to get the Bad Dog and get the Great One. Summon only would be fun. I do love a good summon team. Yeah, so we're almost done with this one, so you guys can just spit out ideas of other restrictions that we can put on for the next one. And if we have to create a, a custom pack, that's fine with me. I know the brain cramp, He the melon is very, very good. It saved me a lot. And also the the fruit, the Yggdrasil fruit. Yeah, I might sell the Shuchiniko. I don't know. Ooh. Nice. Oh no. I think Buick might have me. I might go mana. We're gonna level up there first though. There's another chocolate. So I think we're gonna sell the Shuchaniko like Gaming Grandpa was suggesting. And then we need to get something else on the brain cramp. Like... I don't know, there's not really any protection or anything. Maybe the health? Oh, the tomato! Dang. You're right, they all have perks, so that's 
That's true. There's a... Okay, level up. What were you saying? You were saying... Yeah, if I can find the bad dog... There he is. Oh, I could buy... But then I'd be down one of them. You know what? Screw it. Let's go for it. We're gonna do... But the thing is... Badger has... JJ's got some of those guys. So I think we gotta go with Pandora's box. And then I have to sell him because I can't have him. I got silenced. Dang. Well, it was a good it was a good try. Okay, let's spectate the very last bit of it. Yeah, Badger's looking good. He's got his double frog. And then Buick's got two hearts. And he's got some good stats on the Shuchiniko and other ones. You bought six peaches? Is that how you got your Shuchaniko that big? Or were you putting it on the tiger bug as well? Okay, let's see. So the tomato's not gonna be enough. Okay. All right, we're down one to one. So do you guys want to go all summons next or keep, do you want to do another one of the jump only? What are you guys feeling? You could freeze the cornucopia, try to get something for your tiger bug. Okay, let's see. This might be the final bit. Pierce says yes, but yes to what? All summon. Okay. So we got one person saying all summon. Ooh, it wasted the, the man on that one. Okay, so JJ, GG. The all friends or no friends pack I started earlier might be interesting. What does that mean? The all friends. Okay, let's let's start building this out. So summons only. So what would classify as a summon in here? Cause like Beetle it has the honey. Cricket, of course. Sneaky Egg summons. Um, Groundhog doesn't really summon anything. Let's see. Go Apple. We go Egg instead of Peach. Yeah, Cricket for sure. Yeah, just kind of blurt out the the pet names in here. And I'll, I'll keep an eye on chat and I'll kind of go through. So Dirty Rat, the Beluga Sturgeon, um, the Stork, Spider. Is that all the summons for this one? Oh, Spider. Does Stoke count as a summon? I 
Um, lizard. Frogeman said, I came up with an idea with no friends being where no pets on your team can have the same trigger while all friends is the opposite. Everything has to have the same ability trigger. Nightcrawler. Oh, Nightcrawler is a summon. Yeah. Yeah, I got the lizard. Um, I'd say cherry kind of counts. I always like adding pill. And then gingerbread is good. Not stoat. Stoat doesn't count. Should we add pets like sea turtle and horse? Because they, they work well with summons. keep going through on the ones that I know. I mean, that, that kind of counters a summon. It says summoned. Sheep. Owl summons. Robin. Did I miss the Robin? There he is. Yeah, I have Stork. I, I marked down Stork. Um... That one summons. He summons. Um, Ant Eater summons. Are the enablers for shop only or also in battle? What do you mean by that? Like if you buy, so like guinea pig? Guinea pig would be, where is it? Man, where's the guinea pig? Am I blind? <laughs> where's the... Yeah, mole. Oh, guinea pig's tier two. That's my bad. Um, I don't think any of those... We could do Royal Flycatcher. What do you, what do you guys think about that? Yes or no? Um, of course, deer, whale. It's not really summoning; it's transforming. We could do Parrot because that copies everything. That one summons, summon. Chimera summons. Um, gotta add some support pets as well. Slug, I got slug. Mantis? Um, you, do you guys want Mantis? Falcon. Falcon does summon. Okay, then we'll go here. Banana summons. Add the Kukatu. Or cockatoo. Okay. Um, I think that's it for that one. We'll go eagle, rooster. Um, cack summons. Seagull. Okay, let's see. Wolf summons. Gotta scroll back up. Where's the 
So seagull. So what should we get rid of then? Chimera? Because it does summon, but like... Are we able to use every pet you put in or just the summoners? I think every pet. Or... I mean, for ones like this one... Let... I don't know. Let's just say summoners. But do we want friends that help? So like a turkey or something like that? What do you guys think? Because we could just do all summons. Um, did I did I grab Pelican instead? I did. There he is. They look similar to me sometimes. Thanks for pointing that out. Nessie does summon. So Nessie's right there. What else is there? Yeah, I, I fixed it. I think adding eggplant will be fun too. Um, so we need two more pets. And I'm fine with adding some. Oh, Kappa does. Um, let's see. Vulture. Well, the question is, do we want to do only summon pets? So, like, you can't have turkey, you can't have seagull, stuff like that. Or do we want to have pets that can help? Um, summon. That one resummons Jersey Devil. Do you want which one do you want? Turkey or Jersey Devil? I think by African vulture you mean Egyptian vulture. And that one's not really summon, it's just I guess it could kind of work with it though. Tiger. Um, let's see here. Cerberus summons. Hydra summons. The Le Leviathan summons. So we need two more on on tier six. I I do agree. Turkey is better than Jersey Devil. Because you have to sell so many tier threes. Um, anglerfish that, that kind of summons oh I'm missing orca yeah we got the orca I feel like we shouldn't bring in tiger though because it doesn't summon right Take out the Egyptian vulture for the Jersey Devil. Okay. Done. Um, so do we want Spino? Do we want German Shepherd? Grizzly Bear doesn't count because it's just attacks. It's not summons. I'm going to go Spino. I was thinking of going Oyster. 
Maybe we go oyster instead of dangler fish? Or the angler fish? Okay, we gotta choose a couple more here. Oh, flying fish. Um, bear, kind of. Octo? Octo doesn't summon. Um, oh, Pegasus works with that. I have the Pteranodon. Okay, the only one is tier ones. Um, does Groundhog count? Did I miss Mole? I did miss Mole. So we'll get rid of Bear and go Mole instead. Um, I'm just trying to go for other pets that can like possibly help. Um, Chinchilla kind of summons, yeah. How about this? Um, if you buy the chinchilla, you can only have the loyal chinchilla since it's summoned. Does that work? Okay, I think that will be good. Here, I'm gonna scroll over it. You guys tell me. Ant with pill? So the thing is you have to have a pet that summons, or I guess, let me look over this and see. Um, yeah, you can have any of these pets. Yeah, any pet, Pierce. Summons only. I'll put the deer on there. Okay. Oops. Okay, let's go. We're doing salmon. I know, Royal Flycatcher is a little strong. I might, maybe after this one, we'll, de we'll determine if we're gonna take that one out. Yeah, so the code is salmon. You can join. You don't have to have all the packs or anything. Okay, we got a couple of you guys hopping in. Deer King counts, I think. Um, maybe. It's a little too late, though. We'll, we'll see how this one goes, and then we'll do another one. Um, and then we'll kind of evaluate, so. Groundhog, because no trumpet users anyway. Is Groundhog the only trumpet one that I have in there? I think it is. Okay, I'll wait 10 more seconds or so. Oh, you're just thinking because I chose pill? Um, yeah, I'm trying to think, like if you, if we had shark or something, yeah, cherries in here. <laughs> Deer King summons bacon. He's my spirit animal. All right, let's get started. 
So yeah, you can buy any pet in this pack. Oh shoot. This is not a good start. So we got quite a few of you guys in here. See how we do on this one. And then I have to sell because it has a sell ability. Cricket, of course. Let's go buy sell there. Sneaky egg, of course. And then I want to try to get rid of these guys as soon as possible. Because I don't feel like it's entirely a summon. I don't know. What do you guys think? Is it too strong? Should I not have them? I think I think I should take him out. Oh, I hit balloon instead. Nice. Nice. Oh, I guess that counts cuz it's And I'll keep rolling. That's good. Cherries is good. Okay, I feel better about this because it's more summons. Okay, let's see. I'm switching up the music again. I don't know why, but I feel like my Wi-Fi is being very slow. Has the stream been laggy at all? Okay, he gets taken out. Ooh. Yeah, the sea turtle's tough. I need to find the sea turtle. Go. There he is. Um, Hill can work with him because then we get more money. And then we'll buy a ferret. I think that'll be good. Okay, let's see what everyone else... Oh, shoot, Pierce. <laughs> you got the Royal Flycatcher, shoot. I feel like everyone's going to go with Royal Flycatcher and then have some type of summon or, like, summon aid and then summon. Parsley, you have your lizard in the front. Okay, Badger is going with the Owl Strat. Okay, he's gonna survive. I think we have enough summons. Oh shoot, I forgot about the Aardvark. 
Oh, Aardvark's good. Yeah, I'm gonna grab Aardvark. Yeah, that was dumb of me. So now he goes in the back. We're gonna sell, so now we're gonna be at 12. Buy, sell a ferret. Go tennis ball. Um, bring in you. I'm gonna sell. He's just big though. So we're gonna go Aardvark. And then I'll grab the fig. Ooh, flying fish instead of the horse. Maybe Aardvark and Flycatcher were a mistake. Yeah, it kind of takes out the purpose of doing summons. So we're probably going to have to take them out. Shoot. By one. Okay. Um, he's out. Over there. Oh, I should have put garlic on him instead. Okay. Yeah, I think on the next iteration, we'll get rid of um, Aardvark and Royal Flycatcher. Because I think there's some other summons in there that we can get. Maybe not exact summons, but a little bit better. Is Sloth a summon? If you find a Sloth, buy it. You can buy it. 100%. Sloth will... We won't be mad at you for buying a Sloth. So. I know I don't always buy it in my videos, though. I know I got called, called out for it today. I guess I could have froze a gingerbread man and put that on the stork. <laughs> for one round. Okay, let's see here. Oh. Oh, it's just one friend summon. That's actually crazy. Oh, I didn't realize Pegasus went like that. Okay. Um, I'll go there, there. And then like that. So who has the sloth? He's got the sloth. Look at it, guys. The only thing is, it's not... Thanks for my first win. Yeah, that was... I didn't realize Pegasus was that good. If it summons, then it... Gives three attack. We got rid of the sloth now. Now, what else do we have? Um, 
Honestly, if you could get like a seagull build going, that would be nice. I think instead of pill, I'm gonna put in rice. I think that'll work a little bit better. What do you guys think? Oh, he got... Dang it. Okay, barely surviving. <laughs> I'm on one heart. Okay, level up there. Macaque's pretty good, though. Um, I barks out. We'll go vulture instead. And then falcon. There's another one. Oh, deer. Deer's good. So if I can stay alive, we'll buy him, put the garlic on the falcon. Okay, so Psalm's out. JJ's close. And then I'm very close as well. And then everyone else has two or more hearts. Nobody has five though. Oh, Froze, you're going with the dirty rat. That's a good strat. That's a very good strat. And then, I don't think anyone's going with Owl anymore. Okay, hopefully my Stork doesn't get sniped again. It doesn't matter that my Vulture's not in the back, he got sniped. Oh, no. No! <laughs> no! That was actually really close. That was very close. Oh, you got Nessie. Nice. Okay, so, so far, the pets that are on the chopping block are Hardvark and Royal Flycatcher. And then I'm gonna get, get rid of pill and put rice. Okay, let's see, turkey. Okay, let's look at everyone else. So Froge is still at four. The snooty snacks are still at four. Yeah, I got taken out early. The reason why I didn't put my vulture in the back was because I was afraid of them sniping on the back. But there's no crocodiles in here, so I shouldn't be afraid of that. It's mainly the figs that are doing the damage. Yeah, so Pills out, Hardvark, and Royal Flycatcher are out. Oh, I am loving that. That was nice. You got the Leviathan, JJ. Oh, and now he's getting the Eagles. Can he get another? No. I put Banana on turkey or something like protection or something maybe go beluga whale 
Oh, there's a turkey. The beluga whale would be nice, because then you can get multiple summons. Didn't the cockatoo used to do it to like three pets or something like that? Or two? And it was like one, two. Oh, you got the saber tooth. Oh. And then you got a tapir out of that. Nice. <laughs> you got a bus with no chili. Okay. Both of those look like strong teams, though. You're going to take a break? Um, so I'm planning on just doing one more after this one. So. Honestly, I would get rid of the flying fish. I know you have the, the fruit on him. I'll probably go fly or saber tooth. Yeah, so I'm going to do one more. I'm going to edit the pack. Then we'll do one more summon one. And then I think that'll be the end of the stream. It's going to be a shorter one today. Okay, let's look at Froge. What he's got. So he's got some good summons. I mean... It's a dirty combo having the Royal Flycatcher and the Aardvark together with the rat. Yeah, Parsa, we're going to get rid of it. Hey, JJ, thanks for joining. It was good seeing you. I guess not seeing you, but having you join the stream. So. Oh, that was a good snipe. Oh, and you got a Hydra out of it. And you got a Spino. Oh. Yeah, I'm taking those out. Those are way too strong. It defeats the whole purpose of having summons. Honestly, probably just buy the popcorn. Or combine the rats. Probably go popcorn though. To keep them separate. So there's four of you left. Oh, you got the Kappa. Oh, whale and Kappa, that's actually really nice. Because then it's going to summon the 1416 pet from above tier three, so you could get a tier six. Hey, Froge, it's okay, no worries. Hey, that's what we were working with, and I said any pets, so you went with the best stuff that you got, so. You're just too good for us, Froge. Okay, we're coming down to the wire. It's weird that when you're spectating, it doesn't say how many people you're waiting for. Okay, let's see. These are a lot of good summons. Ooh. Those are good snipes. <laughs> no. Yeah, that that build is dirty. Okay, well. Yeah, you gotta sat them up so they don't die. So we're down to three now. Oh, and 
now you have level two. Deals five damage. That's good. Okay, let's see how this one goes. Okay, he's gonna miss out on some summons. Okay, you got a bus with no chili. Holy crap. He's huge. Okay, Raptor might have a chance at this one. As soon as I heard the Royal Flycatcher was getting put in, I knew I was gonna use it. Yeah. When I put it in, I was like, eh, this might not be the best. Because it might just throw off everything. All right, so there's three more left. I think it's going to be between Froge and Raptor here. You got to love the effort by JJ with the fish. So are there any other changes that you guys can think of besides removing the Aardvark, Royal Flycatcher, and Hill? Oh, he lost out on, a su on two summons, actually. Ooh, Guest is not out. He's not out just yet. I love a good summon team, though. Um, there's a, a level three. You want to put Deer King in? What level is he? Is he tier three? If he's tier three, I'll put him in for sure. Okay, we're just waiting on, I think, one more person. There we go. Ooh. He did have the mushroom, though. He gets his own bus. Oh, dang. Yeah, we're doing all summons now, Alex. I mean, I've just been doing Unicorn Pack to give you guys a chance to play it, because I know not all of you guys have all the packs, and so by streaming it and doing it like this, you guys have a chance to play it. But I think we've had our feel for it, and we're going to be doing more stuff now. I would try to level up your... Rat or your Aardvark? Probably your rat. So Alex, we're going to be doing one more. We're going to be changing the pack just slightly. Oh, you got a Pegasus. That might help out a bit. Okay, it's down to Frozen, Frozen Raptor. <laughs> Flycatcher falling behind makes me happy. Yeah. Hey, Drive Away, you were doing really good. Yeah, Flycatcher's a little too good in this one. 
So we're going to be taking him out in the Aardvark. We're going to be putting in the Deer Lord instead. And then one more tier three, I'm not too sure about. And then removing the sleeping pill. All right. Hopefully it doesn't end in endless draws like it did last week when I was streaming the unicorn pack. That was crazy. Hey, thanks for joining driveway. Okay, he's going banana. Which I don't know if that's the right call. Okay, he loses out on summon. Uh oh. So he takes him out there. Oh, the secretary bird. That's a good call. There it is. Raptor. GG. Okay. We're doing one more round. We're going to make a slight change to it. So... I'm gonna add rice instead of the pill. And then Aardvark and Flycatcher out. We're adding in Deer Lord. Um, and what else? Do you guys want puppy? Do you guys want bear? I'm not too sure. Um, maybe bear. Uh, friends create. Yeah. Okay. Code is salmon. Let's see. I'm switching up the music. Yeah, so code is salmon. Hey, thanks for joining, Froge. So the one with the turtle pack, from what I'm told, that's just a, a visual glitch. Because last time, if you kick them, then it kind of bans them from the room, and I'd have to close the whole thing. So, yeah, so this is going to be the last one of the night. So, okay, I'll wait about 10 more seconds. So this one's revised a little bit. Go there. And we're staying with the jiggly bits. Okay, let's see how we're gonna go against everyone else. We're waiting on one more person. Okay. He's got the tennis ball. But we're fine. Yeah. Okay, we'll go another one. Buy self ferret. And then horse will be good. So 
So we'll combine the sneaky eggs, bring in the horse, and maybe we can get a sheep or we can get a flying fish. I'm not sure. All right, let's hop into it. And this is the last one of the stream. Oh, that was great snipes. Very good snipes. Okay, combine. Let's go with slime. I haven't gotten a slime before, so we'll bring in the horse first. And then bring in another horse. Yeah, I want to use the whale and kappa. I think that'd be really good. I've never used the, the slime before though. Does it summon multiple? I think it does. I th so I think it builds up. So I don't think it's gonna summon anything right now, right? Oh, the egg. Yeah, so it doesn't summon anything right now. Okay, we'll combine, bring in Stork. Dang, I was hoping for a, for another Stork. And then I'll get two level ups next turn to try to get a, de a deer or a whale. And then probably sell the sneaky egg. Let's look and see what everyone else is doing. Okay, lots of the possums. Oh, he doesn't have any summons, that's why. I was like, why is your sea turtle in the front? Parsa has a good transition team though. Because you can sell, get four gold. And then you can sell the possum to a faint pet. So like a deer or a slug. Almost like half the bats, basically. I've also been trying to do these streams a little bit earlier for you guys, because I know some of you guys are on the other side of the world, so. I think we take a loss on this one, yeah. Oh, it's okay, Bobby. It's all good. We'll go here, Ooh, and there. Buy, sell, crow. And then I'll go platypus. There's another slime. I need to find more storks though. So we could get a level two slime. So pretty soon we're gonna have to change the positioning of the slime. And I don't know how long I wanna keep him in here for. Everyone's doing pretty well. I think there's a lot of drawing going on. So, waiting on two more people. But how's everyone's week going? Everyone doing pretty good? It's pretty close to the weekend, just one more day. Hmm. 
Yeah, so I think if I don't find a stork, I'll use the chocolate on the stork just to get a level two. And I think that'll help my team out a lot. Yeah, that's a good snipe. Oh, he's blue. Nice, those are good stats. I kind of want to go for the slime. Um, achievement. That'd be really cool. A little avocado. And I think the next two or next three things are these guys. If we find a turkey next time, if we level up into a turkey, that'd be huge. Okay, everyone's at four except for these two. I also thought that didn't say abs, which would have been funny. Yeah, I think by taking out the Aardvark and the Royal Flycatcher, it evens things out. It's not left up to chance as much. I mean, there's still chance with rolling, but like the snipes aren't as random, so it, it helps out a bit. That looks like a good team that Raptor has. Um, Oh, using gingerbread with mole. That's nice. Three, two, one. Okay, let's see. Just enough to take him out. Ooh, barely, barely hanging on there. Okay. Don't want any of that. We'll go level up there. Um, I think I want to go Beluga Whale instead. sell level up ooh he could eat a wolf so sell what what kind of food i think cherries will be good So we'll put cherries onto him. So now he's gonna summon two, so we gotta put him back. And then we're gonna sell the beaver next. We didn't sell just so we could have some extra pets. Oh, he got a stork, no. Yeah, the beluga wolf is good. Slug. There's a deer. So I'll sell here. Grab the deer. And then... I guess gingerbread. All right. And he's almost going to summon three. So that's going to be crazy. So I think once he starts summoning four, we got to put him, we got to swap the positions of the beluga. 
And then next turn, if we can roll into a turkey, we could put the turkey there instead of the horse. And then I think our team will just keep leveling up. So I think we should check to see what everyone else is doing as well. Okay, so Psalm's out. There's one, two, three, four, five, six of us. He got a, an eagle though. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay, that kind of worked out. Okay, we're good. I'm feeling good about this team. We'll go there, and then we'll put the fruit on him, save the chocolate. Oh, I want to go Kappa. I'm not going to though. I'm staying with what I got. Okay, so AJ's out. Streamer luck. Yeah, I'm getting very lucky right now. I got some good RNG. I'm surprised no one went with the Deer Lord, though. Because someone suggested it. It might have been Badger. Ooh. He got a bus. Look at the slimes. Slime minions. Okay, I think they got a switch now, right? I think so. So then level up here. Um yeah, keep rolling. I kind of want to go eagle instead of deer. What do you guys think? I don't know. I could have won whale and kappa. That could have been good. Okay. So Parsa's almost out. He's using the mole strat. Fact is using the Kappa whale. That's what I was kind of wanting to use. And then Secretary Bird, ooh. That's actually very, very good. Also Raptor, I would put the, the Secretary Bird behind the flying fish. Just so then he gets more triggers. Hey, thanks for joining, Frogeman. Okay, you got Nessie. Oh, he's huge. I got the wolf. Yeah. Oh, that was against a clone. I'm 
I'm just gonna stick with what I got. There's another. Okay. So he's pushing the enemy one space forward. So that would only throw off Raptor. So he's going to summon four. That's crazy. The background music sounds like from a game from called Bokura. Bokura? So this is from Animal Crossing. It's the Ode to Cap'n. I might use the eggplant. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Hey, bedtime. How's it going? So we're, this is the last one of the night. Oh, that's a huge whale. Okay, I don't know if my... Oh, the fruit saved me. That's actually crazy. Okay, I think I gotta go there for the level three. I'm, I'm not gonna use the eggplant. That one was crazy though. That was against... Oh, I took him out. Your secretary bird? Absolutely insane. It kept hitting your whale and it went crazy. I guess the spino. I'll have to check out that game, the Bokura. What's it about? Kappa whale and secretary is broken. I, I was watching that and I was like, that is crazy. Also with your Spino. Yeah, I barely made it through. Okay, let's see. Oh, Orca, I forgot we have Orca in this pack. Okay, I miss out on the summon there. But I think I'm okay. It depends. Okay. This slime is killing it, though. Okay, me and Raptor. Um, I'm gonna go Cornucopia. Try to get a... Dang it. I was hoping for a mushroom. Um, let's make him bigger. GG, Parsa. Want to try something cool but Nessie in front and Pteranodon and Parrot behind and just summon three 2020s every turn? Yeah. <clears throat> Okay, he's huge. Okay, we're good. Slime is actually really good. I know you guys didn't get a seat at the very end, but he was gonna be summoning like five different slimes. So GG to you guys. That one was really fun. I think we'll do that one again on another stream. So, but yeah, that'll do it for this stream. Thanks for tuning in guys. And thanks for participating commenting, liking, and subscribing. I really do appreciate it. 
it makes my day every time you guys subscribe and like so yeah i hope you guys have a good night or a good morning i know parsa it's a morning for you so yeah thanks for tuning in i'll catch you guys later